What are your thoughts on the primordial black holes? Some papers say that these are micro black holes and they are responsible for dark matter. Also, I wonder how matter was compressed below the Schwarzschild radius to form them if they exist or is there some other way? So primordial black holes are supposed to, are, are believed to uh, be those microscopic black holes that were born perhaps in very large numbers in the very, very early universe, in the infancy of the universe, when the universe was so, so small and so squeezed together that a very small quantum fluctuation would create a region of, uh, of, of matter over density in which the matter was compressed beyond its fossil radius. And maybe there was an overproduction of micro black holes at various epochs in the very early universe. During the pre-inflation phase, maybe during the inflation phase, maybe during the reheating phase, recombination phase, wherever. Okay, there are several scenarios that, that point towards a possible overproduction of primordial black holes in the very early universe, in the, in the various early stages of the universe's existence. So that's a mechanism by which primordial black holes could have formed. Okay, now we know that the early universe was, was very hot and primordial black holes were in this soup of radiation, which means they could have possibly accreted matter over time. And then the universe expanded, became cooler, and then the primordial black holes would have started radiating because they became hotter than the, the environment. And as we know, like we discussed, the Hawking radiation, every black hole has a temperature. The, small, the, the smaller it is, the hotter it gets, and so on. Uh, so it's possible that some of those black holes born in the very early stages of the universe may still exist today, if they were born with a certain kind of amount of mass. Um, if that is the case, then we should be able to detect them. We should be able to detect the end stage explosions of primordial black holes, but we have never seen that. We can detect gamma ray bursts, we can detect other things, cosmic rays and so on, but we have never detected what, what seems to be an exploding primordial black hole. Why is that? Um, it, does it mean that primordial black holes never existed? Does it mean that they all evaporated long time ago? Or does it mean that they are still tied up somewhere else in some form? Yeah, so that's my thoughts about the primordial black holes. Uh, they could be responsible for dark matter as a component of, of dark matter um, and so on. Maybe if they formed stable bound states, gravitational bound states, in which they don't decay, don't evaporate, then they could perhaps uh, form be a component of dark matter there is also the the possibility that uh, uh once it evaporates enough there's a there's a plank si plank mass sized particle that's left behind which is either called a plankon or a cornucopion or whatever which doesn't decay which is stable so that's one possibility that that once a black hole primordial black hole evaporates out and it reaches the plank mass then it cannot evaporate any further and then you have these remnant remnants incredible amounts of Planck mass sized remnants of primordial black holes which cannot evaporate any, any further and which are purely gravitating objects that could certainly be a viable uh, form of dark matter if that exists but do they exist we don't know because it's very hard to detect them almost impossible using current technology.